Hello friends, so this is your friend Arun from Live in Germany channel. So welcome to my channel guys. So on today's news, I'm going to talk about five different news or oh, five different news and two of them is going to be related to economy, one regarding the Corona medicine and the last two is about the wildlife, which I think is also important for everybody to know. Uh, so let's go on to the today's news. So before I jump for those who are new, please do click on the subscribe button. Share the news with your friends so that you can watch German news every day in English as well as like our Facebook page and join us on Telegram. So let's move on. So the first news is uh, regarding the first drug approval or active ingredient approval against Corona by the EU Commission. So this was announced today very uh, fresh. So the REM Desivir, I think I have spelled it right. The doctors can correct me. So this medicine is going to be the first medicine or first ingredient to be in a medicine which has been approved. So this was actually created during the Ebola outbreak and it was not so useful at this time. But they found this ingredient could actually help or control the uh, corona in the body, if I'm correct. So we hope this is a very good sign and experts have also said this is a very positive sign towards the a uh, rightful solution so other things will also come so this is a very very crucial news so what is the other two news so the second news is regarding economy so the first one is uh, regarding uh, uh, the car sales the car sales i mean the automotive sector has been dropping we have seen in the previous videos especially but they have compared and brought a statistic that the car sales has dropped to as low as it was in 1989. So most of you who are watching this video would not have even born at this time. So around the sales have dropped so badly, but there is a positive news uh, apart from that. So the number of electric cars, car sales has also increased during this time, almost 90%. So 90,000 vehicles, electric vehicles has been registered. So you can see, see a shift of uh, you know drives happening uh, right now so this could mean that in future electric cars will get more priority and the motive of the government is also going in the right direction so another news which is also related to environment as well as economy the coal power plants so coal i have spoken about coal power plants will be removed in future in the, the previous year videos so today the parliament has given a nod saying by 2038 all the power plants which use coal as fuel so coal power plants will be closed so this means there will be only renewable energy after this time or at least this type of power plants will be completely closed the reactions from the government side is positive but the reaction from opposition especially greens they were like went to top of the parliament building and hold posters saying that we want it to be closed or shorter and this is a huge mistake because they were expecting it to be somewhere around 2030. And AFD has said, the alternate for Deutschland party, has said like, this is something wantonly they are putting down this industry and it is not good. But German government is giving us an aid of almost 40 billion euros to the coal producing countries because they are closing down their power plants and 4 billion euros to the coal operators like coal power plant operators so they are also trying to help them out to come out of this so this is one way positive one way negative so it's a kind of a mixed news so the other last two news is from the wildlife for wildlife lovers so one first i'll tell the positive news so in the north coast of germany you have these gray whales for those who are living in Lower Saxony or in the island uh, part of Germany, you would have seen this. So for information, they are the largest predator along the north coast of Germany and their numbers have almost increased by 30% due to Corona. I mean, Corona has helped indirectly in the sense uh, the number of tourists visiting the uh, region has reduced. So because of this, the traffic in the oceans and these are surrounding region is comparatively less and this has given them enough space and maybe uh, the environment for them to uh, reproduce faster or like in a good condition so this has boosted the numbers the environmentals are kind of happy and other news is these gray seals can or has been traveling from the uh, part of netherland until the british water so this is a very good sign we can see a lot of wildlife uh, is coming back to or regenerating itself and the next news is kind of very sad. It does not happen something in Germany, but someone like a, a, I mean, a, like an animal lover or an elephant lover, I found it very pity that this news has not reached its lime, uh, limelight because of the current Corona. This has been put down. So I want to bring it to notice of my subscribers at least. So the news is following. So 
almost 275 elephant carcass has been found in the country above South Africa called as Botswana. You can Google Botswana immediately. This news will pop up. This is going like, uh, like fire. So almost 275 animals died, not in a day, but from starting of month of May, they have found bodies of animals lying near water pits, randomly or uh, near the trees and so on. But what I thought was, okay, this is another case of poaching happening because there is no one to control these poachers. But no, the surprising part is none of its tusks were removed. So all the bodies had their tusks intact. And this was not a case of poisoning the water or poisoning food as well because other animals were not dead because of this. And what else they expected? There could be, it could be anthrax, which is also a common condition uh, among animals during the dry season. But no, only elephants has died and this was also not found. So right now the scientists are, have taken bloods from this region. What, has ca what is causing this pandemic and results are not yet known. Only one thing they have recorded so far is they could see that these animals go in completely normally walking. Suddenly they go in circles and they die. So this could be some kind of neurological condition according to expert. But this is only a hunch. We don't know for sure. I hope that this Corona time will not sideline this problem and this will be highlighted. And we should also find a way to save these elephants also. So I hope this information was informative guys. I'll come again with another informative video. Thanks for watching this patiently. I think it was a bit longer because we had a lot of news. See you tomorrow and uh, bye bye and have a nice weekend. Bye.